Welcome to The Prudent Pulse and hope you had a nice Labor Day. We're covering the week of September 2nd to the 6th. Now we enter what has historically been the worst month for U.S. stocks, and I'm talking about September. We start the month on the back foot with U.S. manufacturing showing continued weakness in August. And while the report was slightly better than July's, another month of manufacturing contraction suggests that activity could be slow for a while. Now the big report though that everyone is waiting for is the August jobs report on Friday. Now, July was pretty disappointing with only 114,000 new jobs. For August, the street is expecting job growth of 161,000, with the unemployment rate ticking down slightly to 4.2%. But if we do get another downbeat report, let's say in the low 100,000s or sub 100,000, that could pressure the Fed to cut more than 25 basis points in two weeks. In my opinion, the Fed would ideally like to cut just 25. If they do end up cutting by 50, I don't think it's a good thing for the market because it'd be done out of necessity to address a more rapid slowdown than was previously anticipated. And that's this week's Prudent Pulse.